Hi everyone, it's Phil here from Ashland Leather and surprise, here's another irregular sale. If you're seeing this video, that means that the irregular sale is now live. So you can go find it on ashlandleather.com under the sale tab on our website. And let's start off here first with one of my favorite items. This is an English Tan Dublin Capone money clip. We got English Tan Dublin on the outside, English Tan Dublin on the inside. All of these little irregularities in the stitching or in the leather, any type of the construction will make the, the wallet an irregular and we have to reduce the price. I just can't sell it for full price. Let's look at this 100% black shell Cordovan Capone money clip. Beautiful piece of black shell on the outside. Really nice black shell on the inside. You can see it's a little bit of a streak on the left. And here's another Capone money clip. Natural shell Cordovan here. And we also have natural shell on the inside. And this one is really neat because of the Horween measuring machine stamp in the center. And here's a natural Chrome Excel Fat Herbie with some really interesting figuring in the grain on the exterior. We also have that same sort of figuring on the interior. And you can see these bits of healed scars in the leather that makes this one an irregular. And here's a Bugs Moran in color eight shell Cordovan on the exterior with a reverse color eight on the interior. It looks like Horan was using the older ink stamp in the center here. It's a little smaller. And here's another Bugs Moran. This one is the intense blue shell Cordovan. It actually kind of appears black at some angles. In fact, it's just too dark for me to even consider it a blue shade at all. Let's give you a comparison to another Bugs Moran in a blue shade that's also in the regular sale. This one is the denim blue shell Cordovan. And you might be able to see sort of immediately how much lighter the denim blue shell is compared to that intense blue that we were looking at a second ago. Here's a really nice looking Johnny the Fox. This one is an irregular also, and we didn't finish the edge like we do on our normal 100% color eight shell foxes. This one has a natural sort of waxed and burnished edge. We're on our 100% color eight shell foxes now. We're hand staining all of the edges to match the shell color. Here's a Johnny the Fox in natural chrome XL. Really beautiful piece of leather. But this one has like a little bit of dirt in the back spine right here. Let's take a look at the inside. This is black horsehide Latigo. Here's another natural Chrome Excel Johnny the Fox, but this one has a mock horsehide interior. And this one also has little bits of red spots in the finish that you can see here and here. And we'll give you a look at the mock horsehide interior and the black. And we have one more interior. And here's another Johnny the Fox in natural Chrome Excel. And this one has the natural Chrome Excel on the inside. So these are all three of the variations of the natural Chrome Excel Foxes that we do. Here's another Johnny the Fox in one of my favorite shell Cordovan colors. This is color number four shell Cordovan. It's medium brown with reddish undertones. And this one has a mock horsehide interior. And here's that Johnny the Fox I was talking about a minute ago. 100% color eight shell Cordovan. This is how we're making it standard now with these hand stained color eight edges. This one has some inconsistencies and there's actually two of them that have some thread tension issues that might you might be able to see on the top here. The thread's just not sitting perfectly inside of the leather. And here's another color number eight shell Cordovan, Johnny the Fox with some thread tension issues that make it irregular on the top here. It's kind of hard to see, you have to look really closely. The difference here is these have color eight reverse interiors and those natural wax and burnished edges. I actually have three of these available and one of them with this little pink slip in it there's a little bit of an extra bevel gouging on the left side here. It's definitely not our normal standards, so we're gonna reduce the price pretty heavily on this one. And we do have three belts in the irregular sale today. This first one is English Tan Dublin in a size 34. What's irregular about this one is we're getting, we're getting some extra looseness and sort of delamination alongside the adjustment holes here. Here's a really beautiful Frank the Enforcer in the classic color number eight shell Cordovan. Really nice luster on this piece of shell here. We got color eight shell on the back. Here's an irregular from one of our small batch fat Herbies. This again is one of my favorite shell colors. The color number four shell Cordovan on the outside and on the inside, we also have color number four shell. This one's got some little bit of extra texture on the shell on the left here might be difficult to see, but it's not as smooth as our normal shell that we see. Here's another Bugs Moran. Check this one out. Black shell Cordovan on the outside. And it's a really nice piece of black shell. And on the interior, we have reverse black shell Cordovan. I know I'm calling this reverse black and it's obviously not black. This is how the reverse side of the black shell Cordovan looks. It's sometimes a greenish shade, sometimes a little bit more tan. Here's another really cool Frank the Enforcer. And I think this one is actually a shop worn piece. And I believe this top section here is marbled cigar shell Cordovan with some natural shell Cordovan. This one's also hand stitched. We 
We also have the natural shell on the backside. You can see where this one was worn just a little bit. And here's a Bugs Moran in my favorite shell cordovan color, the Amaretto shell cordovan. Just love this sort of orangey tan shade. Some angles, it's a little bit more brown and red. We also have that same Amaretto shell on the outside. And here's another special piece. This is also hand sewn on our fat Herbie. And it looks like we got whiskey shell on top of some reverse shell on the outside. It's really beautiful. And on the inside here, we also have reverse and whiskey shell. We call this a double reverse. Up next here is probably one of the nicest pieces of Chrome Excel that I've ever seen. Just take a look at how bright and shiny and smooth this piece is. It almost looks like a piece of shell cordovan, but this is the color number eight Chrome Excel leather, which is a little bit different. In fact, we actually have a matching color eight horsehide interior for this piece. I don't like we were talking yesterday in the live stream about leather being struck through. The edges of this piece are a little bit of a white color because this color eight horse hide wasn't struck through. Here's one of our brand new keychain belt clips, also in color eight, but this is the color number eight shell cordovan. This piece of hardware wraps around your belt or you can sort of clip it to your belt loops. While we're on the color eight train here, let's take a look at this Bugs Moran color eight Chrome XL with a vertical card slots on the inside. I'll give you a look at this beautiful piece of Chrome XL on the outside first and the vertical card slots on the inside next. Here's another Frank the Enforcer, but in my favorite black leather, this is the Black Dublin from Horwin. You can see this little spot on the bottom. It's almost like a little dent in the bottom left of this piece. Here we have another Bugs Moran and the very rare Whiskey Shell Cordovan. If you're not familiar with the Whiskey Shell, it's a little bit more of a golden shade when compared to the natural shell. It's a little darker, a little bit more golden brown. Here we have a Burnt Ivory Chrome Excel. Johnny the Fox. And the Burnt Ivory is pretty similar to the natural Chrome Excel, but it's a little bit darker. On the inside of this one, we have a black horsehide interior. Here's another black horsehide interior, but this one is on our black Dublin leather. I can't shut up about the Dublin leather. And for me, the black Dublin is the best black leather around. This one is blacked out all over, black on the outside, black edges, black interior, even the reverse side of the leather is black. And speaking of black, I have one black Chrome XL belt. It looks like we can get a 36 out of this one. It's the largest size we can get. The uh, adjustment side here has not yet been cut to size. So if you're 34, we can cut it to that size. Or 33, 32, whatever you want. Up next is one of my favorite small batch items we've done ever. This is a Fat Herbie in color number four shell cordovan and it's a double reverse. And double reverse means that you get to see shell cordovan and reverse shell cordovan on the outside and on the inside. So here's what the outside looks like. Beautiful piece of color four shell. And on the inside, some reverse shell cordovan here with really great die marks. Here's another small batch piece. This one's a Bugs Moran with a really beautiful looking interior with a couple extra horween ink stamps there. On the outside of this one, we have the Whiskey Shell Cordovan. That's a rare shell color I was talking about. A little bit darker and a little bit more golden when compared to the natural shell. And we've got a couple Frank the Enforcers left here. Check this one out. Denim Blue Shell Cordovan. Really nice blue shade. It ranges from an aqua blue to sometimes a navy shade. Here's another Frank the Enforcer in all reverse black shell cordovan. And again, the reverse black shell is this greenish shade with interesting dye marks. They give us an opportunity to feature the Horween ink stamp. There's some issues on the edges of this wallet. And the last Frank the Enforcer, this one is natural shell cordovan. This one has some weird looks in the shell itself here. Little dark spots that are not the greatest, but otherwise it's a beautiful piece. And here's a look at the last two Johnny the Foxes in the irregular sale. This first one here is English Tan Dublin, and you might be able to see this little bit of uh, cosmetic issue on the outside. I'm not really sure what this is. It's like a big sort of scratchy gouge on the outside. And we have Horsehide English Tan Dublin on the interior. And the other John of the Fox to show you is something that we're not making again. This is the Teal Latigo on the John of the Fox. Really beautiful shade. The way that this Latigo leather from Horween develops patina is very special. It gets darker and brighter and shinier. It's really neat. And on the inside, we have Black Horsehide Latigo. And here's another one of our keychain belt clips. We actually have three irregulars in natural shell cordovan. There's slight issues, little dents and scuffs in the shells for these and they're kind of hard to see. And another natural piece here, but this is a natural Chrome XL Horween leather belt. And this one is a size 34. The difference on this guy is we've got circular holes and the color is a little bit darker than most of the natural Chrome XL belts we've been doing. Another natural piece here on a Bugs Moran, beautiful natural shell on the inside of this, of this little wallet. And on the outside, more natural shell cordovan. I'll give you a look, a little bit larger context. And last but not least is the Fat Herbie here. Check out this huge piece of Amaretto Shell Cordovan. You can see there's little bits of cloudiness in the outside piece of this shell, which makes this one irregular. 
I feel like when this is worn, all that will blend in. And it sort of will not become a non-irregular wallet at that point. Let me give you a look at the Amaretto Show Cordovan on the inside of this one also. And we've got a couple little dents on the top here and on the top right. So that's all the irregular items in the sale today. Hopefully uh, you're able to pick up one of these if you're interested. All of them are at least 20% off. Some of the ones that are a little bit more intense irregularities will reduce even more. But again, you can find all these items on the flash sale page of ashlandleather.com. If you have any questions, you can leave a comment here or send me an email. And I look forward to helping you out. Thanks again for checking it out and have a great weekend.